I want to introduce you to the Autodesk Design Academy. All right, so choose Autodesk Design Academy. And you want to go to learn. There's a lot of great stuff on this website. Uh, but we're going to start with learning. And we're going to choose product tutorials. And we're waiting. Great. And just scroll down. This is Design Academy. The Autodesk Design Academy is for a lot of different programs that are owned by Autodesk. And there's a lot of great information on all of these programs. Today, we're interested in Autodesk Inventor. All right. So Autodesk Inventor. So we're going to click on Watch and Learn. Excellent. Here we have an extensive list of free training videos for Autodesk Inventor. You don't have to have Inventor on your computer to take advantage of this, but if you do have Inventor, uh, it's a good idea to open it up and to play and examine Autodesk Inventor um, as you're watching these videos. Unfortunately, at the moment, Autodesk Inventor is not currently working on this computer. But uh, let me go ahead and show you. Uh, this is Primary Environments, and that's the first video that you should get started with. And just go ahead and click it. These are all YouTube videos, so if you can see a YouTube video, you can watch these videos. The nice thing is right here, they are Learn all organized. And they're going to get you started and working through... Um, some files, of the elementary IDW, things you need to learn computers. to get started with Autodesk Inventor. The extension IDW. So let me pause that. And as we look up here, primary environments, this is going to help you um, understand the environment that you're working with inside um, Autodesk Inventor. Um, the task panes, the ribbon, the tabs, what they mean and how to get started with them. And UI navigation one and two also going to perform the same function. Uh, graphics window display, navigation control. Uh, these all get you started with understanding all these different features that you can see when you open Autodesk Inventor. Then we start to get into project files and the sketch plane and the browser. Now you're starting to get ready to start making some parts which is great because once you start getting a nine and 10 here, we start making some parts. We start learning how to constrain them geometrically and dimensionally. And that's when you start really having fun is when you start making parts. All right. So don't be intimidated. Go ahead and get started here. Lots of great information. Excellent way to get started with Autodesk Inventor here in the Autodesk Design Academy.